G'day guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video of 7 Days to Die Alpha 18. How are we doing? Hope you guys are all well. So, we've completed Horde Night last video and we successfully survived in that case as well. Did particularly really good. So, if you really wanted to see that video, please check out the previous video. Um, all I'm going to say is my baseball bat here went to work and did the job. So, yeah, it was a great horde night um, by any standards here. But what we're doing today is I've been wanting to do this um, ever since we've, um, well, pretty much I've gotten to a point where I wanted to start venture out a little bit more from home, which is obviously up here. But um, I wanted to go into the wasteland area and discover the, um, the remaining traders that we've got here in this world. So I've actually found one. And to be honest, um, this is the first time I've actually seen this trader here because I don't know how um, I missed it in my other world, but you know, it is what it is. So let's, um, okay. Uh, there was a few rewards that we did in the previous video, not the Horde Knight, but the one before that. We sort of re uh, went around and grabbed, um, or sorry, did the uh the side mission quests and all that sort of stuff so yeah that was all sorted out which was awesome so with that being said um i may as well have a look and see what this fella has here for us and see if there's anything of interest um so let's see let's see let's see actually don't have anything immediately that i'm interested in the battery bank maybe yeah you know what i might actually grab the battery bank i've got most of my dukes in the car as well sitting in there um in the 4x4 so if i need to i'll um duck out and grab what i need if that's the case but uh for now just sort of plodding along i want to buy some schematics and things like that and i think that's probably All right, for the most part um the most part that I really want to sort of um, pick up so let's um, grab my dukes here and head back and go back into his uh, secret stash so definitely wanted to grab that 100% uh, needle and thread I'm not really interested in that if I it's one of those things if I find I'll I'm okay with but I'm not going to necessarily go out and sort of make purchases and things like that. But things like the, the stru uh, structural brace mod that I know I can use so I can sort of, you know, start modding um, a whole bunch of stuff that I've, got, um, that I've got back at home. And that's the other reason why that I've sort of wanted to do this little uh, expedition is what I'm calling it. Um, so I pretty much want to sort of head out, find other... Ooh, there's a... Oh, I didn't want to do that. All because of you. Anyway, that's alright, doesn't really matter. But yeah, I really wanted to take this uh, this little expedition here and just sort of suss out the wasteland area and see if there's any places like a Cracker Book or, um, or any place that I know that's going to have a lot of um, schematics potentially. And, and of course visit the other um, uh, traders because I know there's two out in this area that I'm aware of. Um, that one that we just visited, that's the first one. Um, that I've actually, um, that I wasn't aware of. So yeah, so it's pretty cool. But basically, um, what I might even end up doing is I might take, um, maybe put this as sort of like a two-parter potentially. Um, we'll sort of go in and see if there's any places around here that I can sort of, um, I can sort of loot. But if I have to sort of stay the night on top of a, a rooftop or something like that, I might just do that. So yeah, so we'll spend some time out in the, the wasteland here and we'll um, see what it has to offer. And hopefully, being that it is an untapped resource at the moment, that I should find some, um, you know, some pretty decent um, POIs. And that's the whole idea of this. But so far, I haven't seen anything of interest, which is really disappointing. So um, let's see what's around this corner here. And I know a lot of people don't really like the wasteland. Um, me, I'm not one to sort of, you know, um, you know, to sort of call residency in in the wasteland. I'd, I'd much, um, you know, uh, prefer the greener biomes. If, if I'm going to be completely honest. Uh, oop, 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 oop. Oh, look at that! Took the corner well. Uh, there is a military bunker here, which is kind of neat. Uh, we've got the barn here. The barn always gives off 
some pretty good loot. Um, you know, if you if you got some pretty decent lucky looter on you, you know, you may as well give it a bit of a shake. Um, but if I come to a dead end, let's take a squeeze of the map here. Um, I might have to back out the other way. So let's just go ahead and do that. Hit the reverse. And let's see if we can do like a little J-turn. Well, no, not really. Doesn't do the uh, the skid or anything like that. Oh well, that's disappointing. Doesn't matter. But let's head in the opposite direction this way. See if there's a way out, which I'm hoping there is. All right. Oop. Sort of try to get a little bit airborne there, but you know, all good. Um. So far. Doesn't seem to be any sort of exit. Alrighty, so what I've found here, guys, is a church. So what I might do is, with the potential of getting uh, schematics from here via the bookshelves, I might might as well go ahead and do this. And also, not only that, but um, definitely go and um, loot the uh, the big loot room. So we may as well do that. So I'm not going to do the whole POI. I'm just going to go ahead and just suss out the, the first part of the area, but also um, the major loot area. So we're going to drop in and um, go in here. But before I do that, just let you know, that's basically the route I sort of took. I sort of double backed and sort of came back this way to try and find, you know, a, a viable path, which, yeah, I wasn't able to do so, which was a bit of a pain beforehand uh, while I had you guys on camera. So, um, yeah, now we can sort of, you know, try our luck I guess and see if we can get any um, nice uh, schematics hello lady oop 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 come on okay oop alright knock you out and come on lady knock you out too and Hawaiian boy you are also gonna yep succumb to the same fate thank you very much I'll take that and let's see if there's anything here there is not right up so let's have a look uh, paper, I really don't want paper. Right, let's look over here. Nothing, nothing. Okay, books, 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 bookcases, come on. Really? Oh, okay. Well, I've already got that, so I don't really need that in particular. Um, no, I've already looked at that. Now, uh, let's see what we've got here. Absolutely nothing. Are you serious? Come on, guys. Uh, stick of dynamite. Okay, well, it's something I haven't read, so that's always good. Oh, here we go. Things I haven't read. What have we got here? Um, okay, so weapons, uh, 9mm weapons, the grade 20% slower. Well, that's good. Happy with that. Uh, find 10% more jewelry and precious gems when looting. Okay, I'm happy with that. Um, so far, so good. Got that. That's not bad. I'm looking for mods. I'm looking more for more mods than anything else. They're, they're my ideal um, my ideal loot pickup. Uh, actually, I probably want to go ahead and grab that while I'm here. Um, okay, nothing. Um, oop, I haven't searched you. Oh, God, really? Let's just don't feed the bears and buy the farm challenge. I'm going to leave them. Take them. Cool. What have we got here? Nothing at all. Alright, so let's head back up. I'm going to go up and um, going to cheat my way through the POI, so I'll show you how I do that. I think you may have seen these a couple times already, but if you haven't, this is going to be the way to do it. I mean, everyone's got their own ways of doing it, but this is the way that I've always done it, and it hasn't let me down so far. So let's just nerd pole our way up. Um, still got a little bit more to go. And oh Jesus! Really, really? Where are you? Are you serious, mate? Are you serious? Far out! All right, I didn't expect that to happen. Usually, that doesn't actually happen. So, anyway, let's just move on. Okay, now let's just get the pistol for this one. Um, and take you out, and you. Very good. That should be it. I think there's only two of them up here, so that's always a good thing. And um, let's just make our way across here. I always put 
frames out just as a bit of a walkway. I don't think I don't know anyone that actually tries to do a bit of a leap of uh, leap of faith or anything like that to try and um, you know, jump their way across. I mean, if you if you do that, well, good luck to you on that. I'm just gonna close that just in case. Take that and that. Uh, working stiff. I'll take all of that. I really don't care about the nails. Oh my god, that is absolute trash. Absolute trash. Um, bandages. I'll take frames. Why not? And let's go ahead and open up this guy and see what the major loot is. Hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll get something pretty decent here. Um, yeah, so like I was saying, look, I, I want to find some more mods. I've got so much um, inventory back at base. As soon as I get all the mods that I can sort of muster. Oops, just get out of that. Um, I can, okay, what do we got? Ooh, all right, not bad. Uh, level 4 baseball bat, not bad, not as good as mine, but... Alright, that's actually not too bad, I'm pr not not mad about that whatsoever. Yeah, so what I was saying, so basically I've got a whole lot of good inventory now that, you know, game stage, everything else in between, Lucky Looter, the rest of it, you're starting to get some pretty decent endgame loot, and, you know, to try and capitalize on that, and especially if you want to buy certain things, so say for example, one thing would be so like a gyrocopter, it does cost a lot of money, especially if you haven't found the schematics for whatever reason, if you haven't found it, or if you haven't been able to purchase it from a in-game trader. Um, you know, it's a really good investment. You can just get a whole lot of cash and then basically you sort of take it from there. And then um, you pretty much just move on, make a whole bunch of money. And that way you don't have to worry about, you know, if you want to buy something, you just go ahead and buy it. You know what I mean? So, I think that's the reason why I sort of want to do it as well. And plus it gives me something to do. So, I can sort of, you know, um, cruise around, discover new areas as well, and just try and learn all the books. I think that's, you know, a, you know, not a bad goal to sort of work with. That's just me. I don't know how you guys feel about that. So, let me know in the comments section down below what you think about this. Um, let's see if I can... Oh, look at that. Just before she tried to get to the wall there, managed to just scrape it. Anyway, so I've noticed in the last couple of videos that I've made, I've noticed there hasn't been a lot of um, uh, viewers. I mean, I average around about 30 odd viewers, which is, look, in the grand scheme of things, it's not a lot. I get that. But in the last couple of videos, I'm lucky to get anywhere between 15 to 20 views. I want to ask why. So, I want to ask for some feedback from you guys. What am I doing? I, am I doing something wrong? Um, is it video quality? Is it um, editing skills? Is it um, engagement from me? Um, could I be doing something a little bit different? Um, is there something that I'm lacking that I could be doing? Or, you know, this is, this is a general thing. So, look, constructive uh, criticism is what I'm after here for, um, from you guys. So. I'm hoping that you know someone that that might want uh, that may want to comment. Let me know what I'm doing, how I'm doing it. Um, is it below standard? Um, should I be looking at some sort of um, I don't know some sort of schedule, some sort of um, rotational routine of the videos? Where you know, do you guys just prefer to see a lot of looting? Do you pref do you like building videos? Um, are you all about just watching horde nights or you know? Should I be doing something else more with the Horde Knights? I don't know. Um, so all, all of these questions here is something that I'm just sort of trying to gauge from everyone and hopefully... Oh, come on, come on, come on. Get out of the, out of his um, cluster there. Uh, yeah, so just really interested to know where, you know, where we stand with all this. Um, okay, so is that another trade? Oh, that is the trader. That's the trader... Um, I know. There we go. Oop, oops, 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 oops. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. This is the. This is so bad. I hate. I hate things like this. In the wasteland, you really. I don't know. It's just really frustrating. Especially, you know, you got to. If you want to um, uh, dodge things like landmines, which is one thing, but also, you know, oh, that's working. Um, Things like um, all um, bits of iron. Ooh, and we've got a doggy there. 
Well, I won't be able to get you, so we'll deal with you a little bit later if that, you know, if that time comes, I guess. Um, nothing there. Nothing there. And do we have anything over here? Nothing there. Anything here? Do you work? You are not working, but I will take the shale. Um, and that's the other thing I've been doing as well. Um, so the reason why the video is a little... Ooh, that works. Okay, cool. Actually, this is going to work in my favour. Um, man, I don't think I have any wood, actually. Uh, let's go ahead and mix up all that. Yeah, that's going to help me out immensely. Um, even now that I'm in the... Um, uh, what do you call it? In the... In the wasteland here. At least I know I've got a working chem station so I can actually, you know, utilize it for the, um, for the, uh, for the fuel, basically. And that's basically where, ooh, I can actually open that too. Yeah, so pretty much, um, I've got that schematic which is good, but I did go on a, on a massive, um, shale mine hunt. So I got quite a bit of decent shale which is not, um, which I won't have any, any issue now cooking up and, you know, even if I stay in the area overnight kind of thing, I can let that cook over um, over the course of the night when the trade is locked. And I should have that, um, you know, a, not a neat little, ooh, a neat little um, uh, bit of fuel. Uh, can I get that bookshelf behind you, buddy? I don't think I can. Someone has mentioned you can actually glitch yourself through if you've got the bicycle across or possibly even the minibike. So I really want to, um, test that theory out and um, yeah try my luck on that one there I won't actually buy that just yet um, let's see what we've got here really nothing that's actually a good mod so I'm gonna buy him and I'll see if it does anything um, different with my baseball bat there so we'll um, we'll suss that out in a moment because I notice if you use like a reinforced club, it significantly increases your damage potential on that as well. And again, I did this in my test world, which was, um, yeah, quite extraordinary. So, um, hoping to do the same thing. Um, power attacks increase the chance of knocking down your enemy. I will um, buy him. No dramas there. Thank you, Survivor. Okay. Check back soon. Yep. Alright, so let's go ahead and learn that. Let's go ahead and... Okay, so what have I got here? I've got a weighted mod. Got the flame mod as well. Okay, so... Alright, hang on. So we're 42. We go down to 39. If I bang this one back in... Alright, we go back to 42. If I remove that, it doesn't really change the fact. Um, how about if I just remove that? And it's all relative. Okay. Hmm. I guess it really doesn't matter. I'm just going to leave it as it is then. Um, yeah, okay. Fair enough. Let's just go ahead and complete that. No dramas, no dramas. Alright. So I'm going to let that shell cook up. And I'll come back to it anyway. What I probably should have done is I probably should have gone a little bit more onto that cook up. But that doesn't matter. Alright. So let's continue on. So the next... Um, the next trader is, isn't actually too far away from here, so we'll um, we'll head down there real quickly, and that's pretty much all the traders that I wanted to do for this little um, expedition. So probably what I'll do now is I might just find a POI, um, clear it out, and we might you know have enough time just sort of camp out for the evening. I think that might be a good way to sort of cap it off here, because I didn't actually expect to get this far, or you know didn't exactly know how far along where I was initially at the video, um, at the beginning of the video, I should say rather, and to where we are now, so, yeah. Kinda neat. Maybe I should do a military bunker? Maybe. That might, that might do the trick, who knows. So this is the other trader that I've got here. And let's just lock you up. Um, while we're here, that's in front of us, that doesn't work. Just grab that as it is. And I usually just go for things like the cement station, just to see what's there. Take the schematic, I can probably sell that, so let's go ahead and do that. You don't look 
so good. Yeah, and we got Trader Gen here. Get some antibiotics for that. So let's just go ahead and sell and go ahead and sell that. Sell some of the cash that we've got here. That I don't really need. Very good. I hope you get feeling better. Okay. Let's see what you've got in your inventory for me. No, I don't want any of that. No, uh, you actually got three lucky goggles. And they're all the same. Well, there you go. Um, nothing interesting, nothing interesting. You know, after everything going and trying to find all, you know, um, you know, uh, the motorbike, um, the handlebars, the chassis, the 4x4, you know, the mini bike. Now they're coming up everywhere. Now that I've got everything, I don't know, they're, they're coming up everywhere. I think I actually might buy those lockers, so we'll take those because I can take them back to home base as well and I'll pop them on my base, so yeah, we'll do that. Uh, learn how to harvest brass from doors, never run out of brass again. Gyrocopter's 80k if I just wanted to buy it straight up, but I think I've got the bits and pieces. Crucible, I know how to make. Um, sniper. Yeah, alright, let's just buy that, why not? Um, may as well just buy that for the experience, why not? Well, you just brightened my day. Okay, no worries. I'm glad I could help you. So, yeah, let's just grab that and that and boop, all good. And, you know, we'll quickly see if there's any interesting POIs for me to sort of tackle. I don't want to do this one that there, if there's a, if there's the other, um, what do you call it? Uh, the other military bunker, I might be more inclined in doing that. We'll spend a bit of time uh, looting that. But so far, I know there's a working stiff in this area because I did go past it beforehand. Um, actually, maybe not this area. But anyway, we'll, we'll go suss it out. So there is a big tower here. I think that is the sham way, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. Um, oh, okay. That's a different military bunker. That looks interesting. Very fortified, actually. Let's, um, let's quickly just roll past here and just see what this one's all about. Actually, there is a military bunker. I've just seen it in the corner. Um, oh, okay. It's like a prison. Cool. Actually, we might do that. Might not do that, to, uh, this video because it is nearly, um, uh, nearly time for, for everyone to start running around. I just realized what the time was. But there is a um, military bunker, I think, over here. Yeah. So whilst we're in the area, I may as well, um, you know, do this one. Why not? But um, I just want to find like a nice little easy area that I can sort of um, hunker up for the evening and um, yeah. Let's see, what do we have around here? There's really not much to sort of speak of. Well, there's that working stiff, so I might as well just go over there. I think I might be able to clear it out quick enough before they start um, start their running measure. And then I might be able to just loot the place while I'm sort of chilling, I guess. Uh. Alright, so let's see how fast I can actually do this. Right, well, this is actually a bigger working stiff. Interesting. Alright, let's do it. Oop. I should actually just do this. Come on. Alright. Alright, howdy guys. How are we doing? Okay. Nice. I was going to say, I thought that was a white for a second, but it was just a military boy. <laughs> Come on, guys. Settle down. Settle down. Thank you very much. Alright. Um, yes. Yes. Yes, you are down. Alright, five more in-game minutes. Let's see how we can do. Oop. Okay. Oop. Okay. Nice. Alright, so it looks like I won't make it, because they will start running, which is fine. I'll be able to deal with this. Alright. Let us... 
Uh, well, let's, let's drink up. Let's eat. Actually, didn't have much heals actually, so that's going to be interesting. Let's uh, go ahead and use this fella before they break through. I don't know why they're not breaking through the the side here, but that's okay. Because if I'm able to, I can just sort of whack them for six. Hello. Come on, guys. Oop. Yes, I know, I know. Come on. All right. You, you can go, um, you know, shake all about if you want. Okay. Oh, look at that. Yeah, <laughs> quick hands. Is there anyone else down here? Oh, Holly. What's going on? Beautiful. All right, so it looks like I've um, exhausted everyone here. And all I probably need to do is I can just sort of go upstairs and, um, and take them out as well. Which I may do. Is this... Oh, okay, alright, fine, fine. This is, um... Not the, um, wood. Oop, oh, fucking... Really? Ooh, I just found a schematic too. Nice. Alright. Um, where to go up? Okay, so what I'm going to do is... Let's just... Take out this. Because... You know, reasons, of course. And that way they have to jump up, which they can't, which I can. And I should have some visitors. Well, I'm, I'm the visitor. Alright. Come on. Nice. And I think that's it. That's everyone here. So I'm going to hunker down here for the evening. And um, basically, we'll get going in the morning and I'll start with looting up all the, everything else in there nice way to sort of bring it in but hopefully you guys enjoyed this one here let me know um as i mentioned um earlier in the video feedback wise how i'm doing with this what i could be doing um to have my videos you know like a little bit better and a little bit more enjoyable for you guys to actually watch and things like that so any feedback is good feedback in my book so if you guys can do that for me that'd be fantastic anyway i'm gonna go ahead and leave it here so i appreciate you guys watching hit the like video uh hit the like button sorry comment down below share if you can that'd be brilliant and if you guys are new to the channel consider subscribing and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos all right guys i'm out take it easy catch you next time